Hey guys, I finally got a chance to do a, for a vlog for the first time when I'm here in Disney, California. Yeah. <laughs> Anaheim, California. This first vlog will be about the apartments and of the course there will be future vlogs. And they won't take as long as this because it's been a couple of months since I've done the uh, other vlog. But it will be about by every week or two that I'll put a vlog up. Well, this one's about the apartments. Um, each apartment will get four to five roommates. The, our apartment has five, so there's two bedrooms. One bedroom has two beds, the other bedroom has three beds, one's a bunk bed. I was the last one here, so I unfortunately got the bunk bed. What are you gonna do? But each, um, each apartment comes fully furnished, and the people, um, your roommates will depend on how old you are and whether you requested them or not. You can request roommates, so if you know somebody ahead of time, you can request to room with them, but you only have a certain amount of time beforehand to get that request in. I didn't request anyone because I didn't know anybody, so oh well. But So you'll get paired with people who are either 21 and over or under, depending if you want a wellness or non-wellness apartment. A wellness apartment means that there is no... Um, drinking allowed and of course non-wellness you can have beer or whatever alcohol you want. Um, currently the apartments run at $134 per week. It used to be $159 and just this semester they lowered it to $134 per week. So that's very good. Okay, Some of the rooms look different. There's probably about at least four different layouts of an apartment you can have. One way is ours, you know, you have the two bedrooms side by side and they're really a long um, living room. Another one is practically just the same thing, only the living, living room is half the distance, so it's like very, very small. I can show you that at another time. Another way is just that a bedroom is on each side, so there's no big difference there at each side of the living room. And the other one is exactly like the housing office which I will also show you and that one is pretty big as well inside the apartment building and it's where two of our Disney people are there for us during normal business hours so if we need any help or if we want to take anything from the housing office you can rent videos they have a good amount of videos to rent Disney related um, cleaning supplies, so they do have vacuums and such, so if you need them. Um, or if you just want to go there and hang out, you they have a TV, a lounge area, and you can play Guitar Hero or karaoke or something, and they have that stuff up there as well, as well as board games. They have board games, so you don't get to bring your whole stash from home. Um, on the second floor of the apartment building, there is a loft or a lounge area outside, so there's a bunch of couches. There's two ping pong tables and a foosball table, which are my favorites. I love ping, playing ping pong, but it took a couple weeks for them to bring it out. But those are there to play. And that's on the first floor. There is no apartments on the first floor. The first floor is the Sarah Bain Gallery, which I haven't gone in yet, but there's a bunch of pictures. Just a picture gallery. And then there's also the Museo. The Museo is also the building next to us, and it's a museum of weird stuff I haven't looked at yet. I plan to, and when I do, I'll tell you about it. But for now, it's still a mystery, and it's right outside our window. And a lot of times they'll have special events, and they get pretty noisy. Like last night, they had some wedding thing called I Do, and the music was blaring, and I couldn't even study. But for now, I guess what's left to do is to show you the apartment and the office building as well as the patio and there is also a gym which is very convenient. Uh, I will show you that as well. So here it is. Is it